Welcome to the installation video of the Kurt 55563 custom vehicle to trailer wiring harness on the 2010 Lexus RX 350. For a better view of the installation, we'll be using a lift. Like most of our installations, this vehicle does not need to be elevated for the install. We estimate this installation to take 20 to 40 minutes, depending on your level of expertise. These are the tools necessary for the install. Begin by opening the back hatch and disconnecting the negative battery cable to ensure your safety and the safety of your vehicle's electrical system. Remove the vehicle's cargo floor coverings and rear scuff plate. Locate and remove the rear trim panels. To do this, remove all plastic fasteners and the plastic tray inserts. Remove the two plastic fasteners holding the side trim in place. Repeat this process on the opposite side. Remove the upper rear access panels on each side. Remove the cargo loops on each side as well. Carefully pull back the trim on the driver's side and locate the vehicle's taillight wiring harness. Separate the taillight wiring harness connectors from the taillight. Insert the Kurt wiring harness with the yellow wire between the corresponding taillight housing connector, making sure all locking tabs are in place. Route the connector with the green wire out from the driver's side trim panel, across the removed scuff panel, and under the passenger side trim panel. Separate the taillight wiring harness connectors from the taillight. Insert the Kurt wiring harness connector between the corresponding taillight housing connector and the taillight wiring harness connector, making sure all locking tabs are in place. Gather and secure any excess wire with the included zip ties at the back of the vehicle. Find a suitable mounting location for the black converter box. We recommend a flat surface protected from road debris. Use the supplied double-sided tape to adhere the black converter box to the chosen location. Prepare the black PAR wire by stripping one end of the wire. Insert the stripped end into the yellow butt connector. Crimp this section together. Remove one pre-stripped end of the red inline fuse holder and insert this end of the wire into the yellow butt connector and crimp this section together. Finally, remove the remaining pre-stripped end of the red inline fuse wire and crimp on the yellow eyelet, making sure a good connection has been made. Remove the positive battery post accessory nut. Place the yellow eyelet of the recently prepared power wire over the accessory post and refasten the accessory nut. Route the black power wire down behind the engine, being extremely careful to route away from moving parts and heat sources. Continue to route the power wire along the length of the vehicle, fastening the power wire with the supplied zip ties. Gain access to the trunk pan area to finish routing the power wire. Trim any power wire excess. A rubber grommet can be used and cut with a utility knife to accommodate the power wire. Reseat the grommet and maintain a weatherproof trunk pan area. Silicone can be used in some cases if desired. Strip the routed power wire end and crimp a yellow butt connector to it.
Insert the power wire of the black converter box into the yellow butt connector and crimp this section together, making sure a strong connection has been made. Replace the vehicle's cargo floor coverings, scuff panel, and anything else you remove during the installation. Route the four flat connector to the center of the vehicle and out of the trunk when in use. Reconnect the negative battery cable. Insert the provided 10 amp fuse into the fuse holder. Be sure to test your new wiring harness with an electrical tester or a properly wired trailer. When not in use, bundle and store the four flat connector in and out of the way. This completes the installation of the Curt 55563 custom vehicle to trailer wiring harness on the 2010 Lexus RX 350. Thank you for watching this video. Now you have the power to bring it. Curt, the first name in towing products.